What's going on everybody, Ace Combat fans around and everybody who is interested in aviation in general. Welcome to the next Ace Combat news update. So today we didn't get anything really big and juicy, but this is very substantial, especially to the franchise itself. As you guys know, uh, the last time we left off on a big update was when the 25th anniversary came out and Kono and Project Aces and the entire team came out with a statement saying, hey, we're sorry we can't really put out much, but here's a little bit of something just for the time being because of COVID-19. It's just been really trash since COVID-19 has come out, but we did get a very special update. Um, not anything huge, obviously, just a little bit of some skins here. Let's go ahead and take a look right here on Twitter. I have some stuff to cover today about exactly what's going on, what people are talking about, stuff like that. So first and foremost, Hoshino comment. Guys, I've said this before in the past. Please follow him on Twitter. Love his fucking art. But he put out this uh, little tweet here, waiting for the next DLC, which features both mock-ups of... The ASFX Shinden 2 with a nice little skin here, and then the CFA 44 Nosferatu. Everybody was going fucking ape shit over this. I also saw Ace Combat fan tweet about this. Kind of created a little bit of uh, conversation propaganda. You know, people were like, oh my god, oh my god, it's happening. Like, the DLC's here. You know what I mean? Like, but Project Ace has actually tweeted this out, which was the official announcement yesterday for the series 25th anniversary second update, which is just featuring the US skin series. And it's actually really, really, really clean. Um, if you guys haven't checked it out, I definitely will link it down below. You can also find it on the official Ace Combat channel, which is right here. So here's the update. It actually features three different skins as well as the United States emblem. Um, personally, my favorite is the Patriot skin. I know a lot of people were excited for the Jolly Rogers and as well as the Red Devil skin. I think they're pretty clean. Uh, I, personally, like I said, my favorite's a Patriot just because I love the color scheme. If you guys don't know, my favorite color is red. Obviously, a lot of the modding community and the PC community is already hopped on this train like years ago. You know what I mean? This is, this is not anything new that we've seen, okay? It's obviously in the past stuff that they're just putting out officially but the positive side of this is that it does give the PC modders and the community more skin slots to work on. So if you guys want to put out anything more, I mean, you definitely can. It just Personally, I mean, I think a lot of people right now in the community are very frustrated, especially with COVID. And it's created a lot of negative conversation as far as, oh, this is all they're putting out. This is the only thing that Ace Combat can do. And it's like, well, no, if you think about it, a, a lot of Ace Combat and Project Aces themselves have been working diligently to put this stuff out as much as possible. And it's hard for them to do so, especially Kono has already stated before, especially in this tweet here that you can see, he says, certainly the influence of Corona is great. However, what I can do now that it pleases the fans even a little, I will continue to seriously work on it. I would like to continue to be such an ace combat team. So obviously they're working as hard, as hard, as hard as possible. I mean, I think even right now, he's the fucking goat for putting anything out for, especially in, in this time period right now. I think people are being very ungrateful for the fact that oh what it's just a simple update that's all you could do is put out some skins it's like well first of all they're a tiny team they're probably still working on the dlc that was supposed to drop months back back in like february march era it, it's so frustrating because at the same time people do have a right to be really frustrated and mad over the fact that everything that they're putting out is so lackluster which i understand because it's just skins and people are doing that on a day-to-day -day basis with the modding community but i would just have to say that for what project days is is doing i would really like for everyone to be respectful it seems like they're also going to be putting out a little bit more of some skin packs because rythus omega or rethus omega i'm sorry if i'm butchering your name i i suck at pronunciations but he did tweet at masato kano or kano and said that well things are escalating a little bit here if you understand clearly the team will be releasing the skin pack today but just for clarification u.s skin series refers them as other skin packs are planned or or is this going to be the only one? Kano responded with, not the only one, we live up to your expectations, thanks. So obviously, I don't think this is going to be the last of the skin packs dropping. They obviously have a lot more to go than just this, but uh, I, I do really hope to see a lot more content dropping in the near future. It does sound like that they're working really hard right now, trying to push out whatever they can, but I just want to rant a little bit on 
I guess the idea of, oh, this isn't enough. They're not doing anything for the community, but I don't know. I beg to differ. That's just me. But hopefully we see something soon and the Nosferatu is getting steps closer into our hands. If you guys are excited, definitely let me know in the comment section below what you would like to see in the near future. That's going to be it for the Ace Combat update news video. Um, if you guys enjoy these, definitely leave a like, subscribe for more. You'll definitely see more coming in the future whenever the updates do drop. And last but not least, if you guys want to catch me on streams, I do stream here. Follow me on Instagram and Twitter for more Ace Combat updates and all that good stuff. Uh, let me know what your favorite skin is in the comment section below. That's it. I'm getting out of here. I love you guys so much. Thank you all so much for watching. And of course, as always, I will see you all in solitude.